Hey guys, here today to do um, a empties video or products that I've used up um, for the last couple of months. And someone wanted to show you his new haircut. Or did he? Say hi everyone. Aren't they adorable? He's so cute. So cute. Hey camera shy okay you can go down now good boy <laughs> okay I've got a nice big container now he wants to play nice big container full I even labeled it um beep beep thank you first one not very exciting um but some Swiss was cotton balls I use these every day, well twice a day when I um, use my toner and um, yeah I find that the Swiss Miss brand's fantastic, it's really soft so um, I always buy these, I don't use any other brand. Don't be noisy. Uh, next one is a 750ml of the Vaseline Aloe um, and it's got sunscreen in it as well, um, all used up. And yeah, I, I did like this at first, but I got sick of it pretty quick. Um, I think my skin slightly reacted to it as well um, because I sort of started to get a few bumps and things and they went away and came back and it was really weird. So I don't know if it was the sunscreen in it or what, but um, so I won't repurchase this one. Um, I'll go on to something else. Actually, I do have something else at the moment. So yeah, that's that one gone. Next is just my travel toothpaste, nothing exciting. I do like Colgate Total, it's good toothpaste. Um, next one is hand cream and I actually had two of these but I threw the other one out stupidly. Um, I go through hand cream like crazy. Um, I am currently using this one at the moment and I'm nearly out of it as well but I probably go through um, a tube of this every four to six weeks because uh, I constantly, I keep it in my handbag and I'm constantly moisturising because I get really dry hands and I love that one, that Nivea one's great. Next is the Lush Almond Smoothie or Almond and Coconut Smoothie. That's all empty. Um, I love this. Um, I use this to shave my legs, basically. Uh, I find it gives a really good close shave so yeah there's a tip for you um I, I like it better than shaving cream so i do need to repurchase another one of those but they're like 26 dollars or something so i don't know when i make it to lush i might get myself one. next one is um a mask a hair mask this is the wella hydro mask oh my nose so itchy hay fever the wind is crazy here in canberra at the moment everyone's drugging it up for hay fever tablets um it's 200 mils it is empty this is our old packaging as well um probably won't repurchase this just because i want to try something different um i sort of never really stick to the same hair mask or well i've never actually found one that's that much of a miracle product that i have to stick to it so yeah, um, I really want to try the macadamia nut one or the Moroccan oil one. So if you guys have tried either of those, uh, let me know your thoughts um, and help me decide which one to get. Oops, I'm just throwing things up the floor. Uh, deodorant, nothing exciting. It's all empty. Um, Dove pink one only comes out once a year. Um, supports breast cancer, so I do normally buy this one. But that's gone. Uh, do, do, do. Stop licking me, dog. Oh, this one here, Revlon Color Stay Eye Makeup Remover. Um, oh, there's the tiniest bit left, but it's normally like two toned. It has the oil and the water, and it's only got that part of it left, so it's kind of useless. Well, not that it was any good in the first place. Worst ever makeup remover. Don't buy it. It doesn't remove your makeup properly. I don't wear waterproof mascara and I had issues trying to get normal mascara off completely. It still left little bits behind so uh, you shouldn't have to scrub your eyes to get your makeup off. So very disappointing. Never buy it again. It was 20 bucks. 
big waste of money. What else have we got in here, Jet? Q-Tex nail polish remover. Um, yeah, I like this one. It's cheap. It's meant to strengthen your nails. Don't know if it actually does, but I like it. Don't want my chip nails. It looks terrible. What else have we got here? Here we go. Oh, Nude by Nature. The light mineral cover. All empty. So any tiny little drabs in there that I can't get out. Um, I do like this product. When I first got it, I used it as just an all-over cover without foundation. But these days I sort of use it over the top just because I find that my rosacea, as I get a little bit older, is getting worse. So I have really red um, cheeks and some broken capillaries. So I need a little bit more coverage than what this provides. Other than that, it's probably one of the best mineral powders that I've used so I do like that one and I probably I won't purchase it again at this stage but I'll probably repurchase it again some other time when I feel the need to have that product. Jet. It's terrible. Next is bio oil. Um, I won't re re there, 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 there. I won't repurchase this at this stage because I only normally use it in winter. Um, I use it all over my body just to help moisturize my skin um, at night time. And yeah, I don't really find I need it in the warmer weather. So next winter, I will get myself another one of those. Uh, the Garnier BB Cream, all empty. This is in the light color. I bought this pretty much you know when it came out and um, I used it for ages and then I just stopped using it because I discovered the skin 79 BB cream which I like a lot better but I did want to finish this and move on from it because I kind of just feel guilty when I buy products like this and don't use it so yeah I still don't think it's a bad product but I just found one better that I like better so um, I probably will not be repurchasing that is well it's by two but it's the same thing um, if you saw my skincare video you know that I do like the Nivea uh, makeup removal wipes these are in the dry and sensitive um, I always repurchase these at the moment I'm using a Johnson Johnson one but I sort of switch between the two so yeah I love them and will repurchase them again Next is also skincare. This was my Nivea Daily Essentials Night Cream, all empty. And I won't repurchase this again. I actually found that it didn't really suit my needs. I didn't feel that it hydrated my skin like a night cream should. Uh, night creams are something I do use a lot more in the colder weather because my skin gets a lot drier. So um, yeah, next winter when I need to get a night cream, probably won't be getting this one i'll look into something else uh, next one is also more skincare and clinique it's my um part of the step three program uh, once again if you saw my skincare routine you will know all about this and of course i will repurchase it this one is the correct one for my skin type which is the dry combination if you can see that um, we're currently um i was what's the word miss sold is not a word but the lady sold me one for the oily combination skin um, because I thought maybe my skin was changing but no it's not and I need to get back to this one so I'm nearly out of that I've got about this much left of my other one so I will go back to this one for dry skin next is a couple of mascaras um, the first one is not completely used up but it's just at that point where it's um oh, something in my eye uh, my god uh this is an empty like used up but it's at the point where just before it starts to get really dry you know how it starts to flick on your face and I hate that so yeah um, and this is the Revlon 
grow luscious plumping mascara and I hate it I don't know why people on YouTube rave about it so much but I hate it and I'm not going to repurchase it because it did absolutely nothing for my lashes so yeah next is the Maybelline one by one volume express it yeah got all used up um, it's old now and I love this mascara and I will definitely repurchase it um, yeah I love it it gives me really good long lashes which is what I want and that's what I look for in a mascara is just length and this achieves that so we will repurchase that for sure last one is a perfume it's a hundred ml bottle um, Eternity Moment by Calvin Klein one of my favorites will definitely repurchase um, I actually already have so if you haven't tried this try it it's beautiful nice and it's just so floral and feminine it's a feminine fragrance I can never say that word um, so yeah that's all gone I can't believe it um it takes me forever if at all to finish a perfume so I know that I really like it if I actually finish one because normally I might get to about halfway or you know three quarters of the way through and I'm like I'm sick of this perfume I can't wear it anymore and my sister scores it so um, yeah this is one that I always go through so yeah that is it for my empties video I hope you enjoyed it um, yeah is there any of these products that you guys use let me know if you've done this video also leave it as a response and um yeah i'll do some more videos this weekend so i'll be seeing you guys very shortly and um i hope you have a great night thanks for watching bye <laughs>